So day one went well. Day one of Comic Palooza. <laughs> uh, I think we wound up with uh, this. Is, like it always seems embarrassing because like it's the very it's sort of the beginning of like our journey through this. It's been a year. Uh, but yeah. these things go slowly. Um, we got uh, 23 something subscriptions, like something like that. Uh, we met a lot of cool people. Gave away some prizes. Gave away prizes. Didn't mention, uh, didn't manage to get rid of our copy of Spice World. Right, but we did get rid of The Quest. Jean, Jean-Claude Van Damme's The Quest. Jean, 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 Jean-Luc Picard's wow, The Quest. Wow, I was about to say, and it's sad. Uh, Jean Benet Ramsey. Oh, don't do that. No, but nobody knows who that is anymore. Right. Um, We're gonna dig up her bones. I saw that on the National Enquirer yesterday. Are they? That feels like a Geraldo kind of like Liberace Spalt kind of thing. Yeah, it's stupid. Or what was it? Um, <laughs> Liberace Spalt. No, um, Al Capone. Al Capone. Yeah. Um, wow, the, we should not be joking no, about no. the bones of Jean Benet Ramsey. Yeah, and spoilers. There's nothing in the the vault. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, what else did we give away? We gave away the VHS. We gave away episode one, Star Wars. Nobody wanted the Batman and Robin. That's right. Somebody wanted. Wanted. So, and okay. Like, Never mind. We we told them what the movies were about. Right. And that one was an Austrian scientist tries to save his ailing wife. Right. While a grieving billionaire foils his plans. Correct. That was the synopsis we gave. Yeah. And they were like, it's Batman and Robin. And he was like, can I trade that for a pearl or something? <laughs> <laughs> something better. And against against your better judgment, uh-huh. I added at the bottom, yes, it is VHS. Correct. And people still, still. were going yes. for it. Yes, because because the novelty. The no- never underestimate the novelty factor. That sounds like a, that could be a superhero name. The Novelty Factor. The no- Never underestimate the Novelty, novelty factor. factor. Dude, is that a yo-yo ball? It is! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> that would be one of his, was, that would be one of his powers. He's got yo-yo bones. Yes. <laughs> Dude, are those original garbage pail kids? <laughs> and like they kill you in a thousand. There's something we actually have. <laughs> what? No, 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 no. I, that was the beginning of a sentence. A new, a new thing. Like something we actually have. We have Heelys. Like, oh, are those Heelys? <laughs> um, either way, I would say for Friday because it is a little slow today. We're on pace. Yeah. Uh, we're planning to do 400. We're planning to have 400 uh, by the end of this con. We're gonna do gangbusters tomorrow. Yeah. I like that term. I don't even know what it means. Gang gangbusters was a program in the 80s, I think. It was similar to like two 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 tips, something like that. Um, and it was supposed to apparently it did some good. I don't know. Yeah, but it's got another definition. No, it's it's a it's a colloquialism. We're gonna do some gangbusters like coke. That's not even heroin. The, that's not even the saying. It's gonna work like gangbusters, because apparently gangbusters work. Or it didn't. That might be an ironic idiom. It might be. Yeah. Or gangbusters could be like like in the twenties when they were gay busting <laughs> busting up gangs. No, it's a particular <laughs> Why are we talking about this? I don't know. I think we've invested like at least 90 minutes 90 seconds into it at this point. Yeah, I, I apologize. But you know, that's just the way it goes to Comic Palooza. I bought some socks. We'll see you tomorrow. We're gonna dress up. Okay, cool. Bye! Day two tomorrow's update. Day's the booze tomorrow.